Conor McGregor is one of the best on the fucking planet. He's one of the greatest fighters on earth right now. He shouldn't be fighting kids that have fucking YouTube videos, okay? All right, Dana White, let me try to understand your logic here. So you're saying that you don't want me to fight Conor McGregor because he's one of the greatest fighters in the world, and I'm just like a YouTuber or whatever. But then, in a statement today, you say, oh, I'm thinking about just having Amanda Nunes knock him out. But she's also one of the greatest. Dana, you seem to have this thing where you sort of hate on video gamers or YouTubers or influencers and us boxing and all this stuff. But then, you spend half your time hanging out with the Nelk Boys. And I know why. It's because they have hella influence over the male audience. And you know that's gonna promote the UFC. And right now, baby, there is nobody in this fucking world who's promoting the UFC as much as me. Tens of millions of views. Number one search result on Google when you type in Conor McGregor, when you type in UFC, when you type in Dana White. Okay, so you're not making sense here. Dana, I know the world doesn't really know this because the UFC is this you know, huge company, but we all know it's not doing that well. I mean, anyone who is involved with WME and all the public stocks and everything that went south there, we know the company's not doing well. And I'm the biggest money fight that you can do unless Khabib comes out of retirement. So if you want the UFC to make the most amount of money, then uh, you better start to wake the fuck up and realize that Jake Paul versus Conor McGregor is gonna happen at some point. I want to beat him up because I don't like the way he strikes. He just looks awkward. It's like a dis disrespect to strike. It's sad that he's knocked out strikers before with that weird striking. Um, he messaged me before, like he wanted me to help him get ready for the Israel Sanya fight. You know what I'm saying? And I kind of like turned it down. And it sucked because they were flooding and stuff like that. So I was kind of glad I didn't go because I didn't want to deal with all that. But it kind of sucks I didn't go because I could have been a help to people who were going through it. But to help Derek Brunson, it's like it would suck because he's probably pretty good in the gym. He probably just sucks. You know, when he's fighting, he looks weird like that. So, I don't know, man. It's like, he messaged me another time after I beat Anthony Hernandez and was like, good fight. You ever try and do me like that, I'll throw you on your head. What type of comment is that? Why are you talking about throwing somebody on their head? And I was like, I messaged him back all hostile. And he kind of was like, bro, I was, you know, trying to see if you wanted to train. You up here tripping. And I was like, don't tell me you're going to throw me on my head. You may talk to other wrestlers like that, but I'm a striker. Don't talk to me like that. That's fighting words.